Ooh, Heist Last Words. That's a really hard level, because there's fog, really tough enemies, and the boss is, like, one of the hardest in the game. He's, like, a level 18 druid with Nosferatu, so it's, like, everything you damage him, he just gets right back. <laughs> this is where the game starts picking up, oh, plot-wise. So no, wait, you get an Indian. No. Oh, no, you get an Indian on the next level. I get an Indian. Yeah, you get an Indian. I get ah. Lee Galt on this level, which is good. We'll both have a thief. Oh, she's going to do sense in yeah. Uh oh, white font on black background. It's the creepy guy. Yeah. How come now he has black font on a white background? Because he's in, he's here. If he's like speaking <laughs> to the spirit realm, it's the opposite. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Why? Okay, hey now, I have a question. Why is it in video games like everyone who's like super evil has golden eyes? Because that's not normal. I apologize to any of your viewers who have golden eyes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's a whole Bond movie about it. <laughs> is there? Golden eye. Oh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, I know there was like the Michael Scarn movie Golden Face. So. <laughs> James Bond Golden Eye. Yeah. We should probably do that as a multiplayer channel. Or, uh, <laughs> that will not be on channel. this channel. <laughs> so, oh yeah, it's the big so, nose guy. I feel like that game's so dated that even though there's blood, it's not like particularly bad. I'm still not gonna show it on my family friendly channel. That's your decision. <laughs> Ruler of the world. I feel like if this game came out now, it would not be E. Oh, definitely not. They'd also probably show think, a lot more of the blood okay, than is, they do. Is Fire Emblem Awakening T? Yeah. Fire Emblem Fates is E10, and that's way stronger than... Oh, really? So far, yeah. It's literally like Elwood with a mustache. Oh, Jafar. I hope I get Jafar. My most trusted the problem, advisor. Okay, the problem is one person will get Jafar and one person will get Nino. Right? If I get Nino, I'm not using her. Not in a co-op playthrough. <laughs> She's hard enough to use in a soul. Mini boss, technically. Is this Cameron or Maximi? We're gonna have to rush to get Leigh Not an Elwood story. Yeah, I mean, it always we're helps to rush. It, we're taking it a little leisurely, though. Okay. Right. You go first on this level, so. I don't think we got any new items, so I don't think it's really. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, well, hang on, Sarah. Do we have any staves that I can I, use? I have one. Uh, I can't remember. I'm pretty sure that's mine. Alright, fine. It's not like you're using Priscilla. You, you got an extra yeah, heal staff I, I there. Like All right, if you say so. I trust you. All right, I, well, I, mean, I need a javelin for a low end, so. Do we have a javelin? I say, I remember I bought a javelin for Ken. Oswin, give me your javelin. Is so Oswin just gonna sit by Merlinus this time? Probably. Well, or dart because there are uh, Pegasus knights yeah. that appear. I feel like that's one's the better choice. Oh, did you want to trade at all? No. I'll save that. Sounds good. And we have to take all three awards on this level. Should we spend money to... No! I know <laughs> what this level has. <laughs> Alright. Um, yep. Okay, so 13. 13. So 13. gets the bonus? We, yeah. Neither of us. We can only get six oh, each. that's right. Okay. So, no Florina. Definitely no Florina. Alright, so I pick my guess first. Well, I have to take Hector. Yep. Taking Kent, taking Matthew for sure. Are you like Raven? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna trade. Yeah, Raven needs more than just a half okay, used yeah. steel sword. Sure I have one you, can you can, yeah. Aren't most of these mine too? I've got the Goddess Icon and the Guiding Ring. I think I have the Hero Crest and the Night Crest. Yeah, I know you've got those two. I'm gonna give. Actually, I'm gonna give him the Chesky too. All right, fair enough. Uh, Oh, she has an un oh, Do unlocks only work um, on doors? Okay. Sorry, now we're missing. There's a lot to play in before you go into battle. Right. Uh, I'm not changing any of the guys that I've taken. This is a bad level for Rebecca, isn't it? I mean, there are a lot of narrow corridors. There, there are a few of them. Oh, wait, I'm trading one more thing. <laughs> <laughs> are you giving uh, Raven the killing? Oh, no. Forgot about Guy. <laughs> you want to take Sane, obviously. No. 
Was he mine? Actually, no, he's mine. Oh, never I have mind. Lucius, yeah, you do. Um, no, I have no, Lucius, because you got Raven. And All right. I think this is good. All right, yeah. Good. Yes, I'm good. Okay. Merlinus. Silver bow. You want to go there? <laughs> oh, you <laughs> the squishier canals. <laughs> Should we even bother taking this guy? That, that, that's got a brave bow in that chest, so you want that. Alright. Well, I'll open this door first. Uh, no, no, Sarah can do that. Can't you? Unlock staff. I don't have an unlock staff. Wait, you said I did. I thought, no, I was asking about the unlock staff because I thought <laughs> I'm going to open this for you. <laughs> okay, well now we're going to have another corridor to, for enemies pouring out of. That's okay. I usually cut through here to get to the yard. Also, the good thing is, if I get legal, chances are I'm getting the members card. You've been hogging the treasure for too long, let's be honest. Yeah, but I mean, I got Matthew. So. I know. I'm gonna send Hector over here to take this guy out. Alright. Just because I know he, the silver bow is not gonna be a problem with him. No. But do you really want Hector to get another instant level up from that sniper? No, but I want him to at least weaken it. He'll probably kill it. It's only got 27 HP. Sweet. I th Let's I see how low it fares. I'm feeling good about this level. Mm. I wouldn't do it. That's, a, that's a bit risky. Especially since, okay, you don't really have anything to gain from that except for the level up, because I'm going to be the one getting the bow. Right, I don't want the bow. Oh yeah, Cameron with the halberd. Two arms! Don't want to go in too far. Let's get out the long sword. Jonathan Ebenezer, indeed. Do you think the Fire Emblem guys are ever like, I, I mean, I don't know why you moved me there, but I guess. <laughs> I could have died, but I guess. They're very obedient. They are. Granted, we play pretty smart. We're not like, alright, and now we're going to have Bart Ray sacrifice himself oh, okay. for the team. So, you almost had Oswin die. Let's not forget. That's the one thing I knew. Before. Oh, he has a door key. Yep. This changes everything. Hey you, what are you doing there? That's my guy. I don't know how he's got these scars. I actually really do want to know why he's got those scars. Pretty sure he falls. <laughs> Thanks for just That's very di <laughs> Yeah, the see if you play on Hector's story, we got starts there. Yeah, okay, that's what I'm used to, and I'm like, oh boy. We'll get him. I'm not really worried. That's fine, you can have a little finish him off, Orlin. Or Oswin. Not Oswin, he no. has an experience. Oh, come on, Oswin, why would you kill him? Yeah, good point. You better kill that sniper, then. I'm killing that sniper. I just, I'm checking to see if Hector can do it. Oh, totally, okay. I kind of want to save the Manicotti. No, no, you get the soul caddy. Oh, there we go, that's what I'm talking about. So yeah, everyone will be able to reach him if he goes there. You need to put Oswin up there just as a tank and then we'll start picking him up. Don't have him go there! I'm not, I'm just checking. Okay, I'm like, everybody will kill him. I don't want to redo the first two parts of this level over again. <laughs> I think this is one of the easier Fire games. Oh, that's Kent. That's I'm sorry. Who needs? <laughs> that's one of the values they're promoting in Big Idea videos. Ah! No! Oh! Why would you do that? <laughs> oh, we are dead. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> okay, the controls stick literally stuck. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Wind, I think, is 
so dead. <laughs> oh, well, that counts as your turn. Oh my gosh! <laughs> okay, this is at least going in the highlight video. <laughs> Hold on. Dark Cloud. <laughs> well, hey, at least that'll be a great highlight video. <laughs> to be fair, uh, I think the GameCube controller is some of the best thumbsticks ever made. That's just for comfort. I don't think that actually affects. All right, all right. Just telling you what I saw. Yeah, then we can send another guy in, like Oswin. Dun da 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 da! Shaman. Shaman. Like. Like Mumbo Jumbo. Eat gum bulk Kill the healer. I almost. I don't have a. Oh. You Should almost I break, end. Should I break this wall? Break it. Sure. <laughs> Mr. Gorbachev, tear down that wall. I don't know if that's what Reagan sounded like, but... What would happen if I you had ended the turn before I got to move? Uh, I don't know. We'd have a fight about that, probably. <laughs> probably, yeah. Ooh, armor Slayer, that's not good. He needs to get the boss and you're gonna take him out of it. Probably. Uh, that's got a lower chance of hitting, and it barely does more damage. Or, well, Lowen is gonna have to. Oh no, Lowen can attack that guy. Hopefully, kill him. It's close enough. <laughs> close enough. You could probably have Dart finish that guy out. Dart can't move that far. Are you kidding me? It's close. Well, he's got the halberd, so do it. Goodbye, Cameroon. Insta level up. So much experience in this game compared to the newer ones. <laughs> well, it makes sense because you can't grind in this one. Well, you can't grind in conquest, but you get way Well, less um, when you desperately need to be healed, so I'm actually gonna mend. <laughs> <laughs> you can't say this episode isn't exciting, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't want to hear you talking about me almost letting Oswin die. Let's just say that, that was your own fault. I mean, that was this. That was your own your fault. Was intentional. I didn't think they moved that far. <laughs> I want to look at that strategy guide and see how far they move. No, I finished that turn. Remember, you skipped your first <laughs> turn. <laughs> Dark is so Paper good. Mario. Paper Mario is as fabulous as I remember it. Which is funny, because mo a lot of the N64 games I found, like I'm like, you know, this isn't as good as I remember. Such as DK64. <laughs> yeah, DK64 is the big one. Whoa, Elwood! You go, man! See, now, in this level, I'm the one taking all the experience. <laughs> Go get him, Lowen. Hopefully the unexpected turn end will not affect our ability to get League Alt. I don't think so. They give me plenty of time. He's just gonna get healed again, so... Paper Mario, though, back on Paper Mario for a sec. Probably my second favorite in 64 game. I, Paper Wait. Mario is my actual uh, second favorite game of all time. Really? It's yeah. Not your favorite yeah. Game of all time. Ocar I don't think anything can possibly beat Ocarina at this point. Really? Just because I've got oh, so much nostalgia, you you're you're not on the chest. Just because like Ocarina, I've got so much nostalgia for at this point. I really don't see a game being able to surpass it. Yeah. Probably. Ba, 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 I should probably ba, ba. have sent Matthew the other way. 
Oh, I just realized nobody's staying back to guard one. Don't guys appear on the slow? Yeah, Pegasus Knights. Where do they appear? I can't remember exactly where. I want to say in the lower left corner. But don't take my word on that. Hey, thanks for opening the door, Legault. You're a pal. Who has to talk to? Uh, either Lynn or Owlwood. So we can get him on his way back. Probably should have asked him. I, I would have done that anyway, so you're good. <laughs> They're like, we can't let Bowen move. Raven's like, I kind of want to get that treasure. Actually, he's going to head back. <laughs> Matthew, can't you make up his mind? <laughs> Just because there's treasure over here, too. Well, Vigalt's going to get that treasure. Not all of it, necessarily. <laughs> yeah, all of it. We can't outrun Vigalt. Yeah, we can't. We can cut him off right here. I can't move Elwood that far. Not on this turn. He's gonna run move, off. You can move up, like a guy here. He's gonna run up. Oh, why would he open the door? To be nice. Ba -ba -da -la, ba -ba. So do you think you have like a top five favorite games of all time list? Ah. <sighs> like running? Because I would agree that Ocarina. I, I know is Ocarina the and Paper Mario are the, definitely the two top. Ah. Uh, also up there, not necessarily my top five though, are Donkey Kong Country 2, um, Mario 64 probably. See, Mario 64 to me, great game, but not like mind blowing at the time, right? Yeah. It created a entire genre of games. I would not put it in my top five, maybe not even my top ten. All right, that's fair. Because I think like that game starts really strong, but I think the later levels. There, are, yeah, not very I strong. think I think it's the middle levels that are the worst. With, like, Shifting Sandland, Dire Dire Docks. I like Dire Dire Docks. Um, Hazy Maze Cave's bad. Well, uh, yeah. I don't know. Okay, but that's... But I, I respect that. Continue. Um, we'll hmm. say, or maybe name 10. Name so have, 10? So you have Ocarina, Paper Mario. I'll say DK Country 2. Okay. Mm, yeah, I'll still go with Mario 64. Okay. The thing is, I'm not counting multiplayer games, or like games that are explicitly multiplayer, because that's, like, a different genre, kind of. It's hard to compare okay. those. Okay, so we'll say your favorite single player game. Yeah, um... I'm going to probably put on Banjo-Kazooie as well. Is this on here? Maybe? I don't know. I should put Awakening. You've probably played Awakening. I, I think I like Awakening more at this point, yeah. Should put that on. Uh, we'll see. Okay, so you have five. Um, hmm. I might put on Fatty Bear or Spy Fox one on there. Those are really fun. Do you want me to count that? Sure. Six. I feel like I'm forgetting some, like, really big one. Oh, he's Luna. I totally forgot about that. Don't die. Well, they're close call with Oswin. It's funny that Oswin is the one who's getting all the close calls. Okay, so you have uh, six. Kingdom Hearts? If I put on a Kingdom Hearts game, it would be two. Yeah, I'll put on two. You're at seven. You have mm. three games left. Like Luigi's Mansion or something like that. Like, Luigi's Mansion was, like, good, but it wasn't that good. Why you put another Zelda? I do really like Majora's Mask. Oh, uh, that's tough. I don't know. I'll have to think about that a bit more. I'm sure a lot of my viewers are like, Oh, <coughs> Lemmings! Hello! Oh, yeah, you put <laughs> Lemmings is probably on there for you, right? See, the thing is, now that I've played some of the custom packs, I'm like, you know, I actually, like, original Lemmings is, like, it's good, and, like, it's very fun, but, like, some of the level design and, like, the custom packs are, like, way better. Well, but you've also had, have had years of dedicated fans, like, doing that, you know what I mean? That's true. Uh... I feel like GameCube, there should be some GameCube games on there. Multiplayer. I, like I said, Melee is my least favorite of the Smash Bros. games. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Alright then. Part of me wants to say something like Minecraft or Bully. Probably not Minecraft in my top 10. I'll start naming mine. Go ahead. So, 
Ocarina is definitely my favorite. Uh, Paper Mario is on there. I'm just gonna oh, I'm, on I'm adding Paper Mario 2 onto mine. Oh, really? Okay. Um, so I've named two. I've done two. I'm gonna yeah. save this game. Alright. I've played this game so much. Um, so that's free. Would you put on a humongous entertainment game? Probably not, because I think they're... Okay, here's my thing. Those are fun games. I think most of my enjoyment for them is nostalgia. Alright. I think from like a gameplay perspective, they're not like super strong, because they're adventure games. If I was going to put an adventure game on, I'd be more like me. Do Tales from the Borderlands. <laughs> no, I would That's a great game, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't be like... On my top. Hmm. Um, I might put something like Portal 2. That's a fun one. Psychonauts. <laughs> oh, Psychonauts is great. Um, or something like Skyrim, maybe. No, oh, yeah. I'll put Skyrim on there. <laughs> so that's my third that I've listed, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, Mega Man Two might be on there for me. Yeah, these are my Mega, Mega Man Two is so Mega good. Mega Man games are good. Um, Hang on. Poison Lance, Axe Reaver, okay. So there's like, I guess for me, there's a bunch of stuff, there's a bunch of games where it's like, they're like some of my favorite experiences of having the games, but like, Journey I don't think is like my favorite. Like you right. Games, but it's one of my favorite experiences of the game. We're same with something like... Uh, oh, come on! He had like a 20% chance of hitting. Same with something like... Uh, Oh yeah. Like something like that where it's like not like good game. Oh, it uh, hey. Like good gameplay. Hey, Oswin. But it's a really good game. Yeah, I agree. So I'm gonna say Ocarina, Wind Waker, Paper Mario. I'll put Portal 2 on there. I'm, I must say I'm surprised that Wind Waker is the one that makes it on there. Wind Waker has some flaws, but every time I play it, it gets better. <laughs> so it's like the anti DK64. <laughs> Hey, come get me, bro. Oh, wait, I put fire up, so I'm on six. Yeah. Maybe Nino Kuni. Because that's the first hmm. that's, that's like a game I played that for probably like 80 hours, and I got the platinum trophy, and I was like, I wish there was more for me to do. Wow. Which I think says a lot. How about Jetpack Joyride? <laughs> Jetpack Joyride is a great mobile game, but not like one of my favorite games. So that's my thing is like I love a lot of like games that you don't really have a lot of that don't really have a lot of gameplay like oh, he didn't go games, after Lynn. Or like the yeah. games or like Oh games. Phoenix right free. But like that's they're a good but one. at the same time they're almost barely games. Same with like nine nine nine, great game, but it's like literally ninety five percent reading. I guess that's true, yeah. So it's like I'm I'm almost and I'm not trying to get into the whole like is it a game, is it not a game debate. But at the same time okay. it's like I, I respect that. What's been your favorite game you've played this year? Oh, like, new game? Or one that you've replayed that you're like, that was just... If we're going off new game, I'd probably say Pikmin 3. Let's do both. Okay, Pikmin 3 is your favorite new game. Yeah, uh... Hard to say for a game I've played before. Uh, that would put it kind of in too much danger, I think. Cause... Yeah, I wouldn't do that. Especially since I'm getting kind of overwhelmed down here. Yeah, I kind of want to send her down to help a little bit. So I'll get her close. Uh, no. I'm trying to think what my favorite game I've played this year is because I've played a lot, but a lot of them have been like smaller games. Um. I really liked um, the. I think it's just called Tomb Raider, but it's like the the, newer the, the one rebooted that's, one kind that's of like based off of Uncharted, basically. Which like Uncharted's based off of the original Tomb Raider, yeah. which then the Tomb Raider. That game was like I thought it would be like, yeah, it's all right. It was like really, really well done. Yeah. And it's not normally like a style of game I enjoy. So like just the fact that I was like, this is great, was. Uh, 
One thing that I would put on for favorite game of 2016, except I technically played it in 2015, was Splatoon. Because yeah, I got I got it for Christmas last year, and yeah. I did play it, and it was amazing. Um, Splatoon is a great time. Um, you haven't played it that much, have you? No. Uh, do you want to rescue Rebecca and kind of get out of there? I did not want League Alt to be the one who opened that. You'll still get it when you get League Alt, right? I know, I'm just... Now I think I, the other I, thief is going to be in front. Right yeah, I don't want to have to kill that thief. That's the problem. Just, just like, lock him in. Like, put a guy here. I don't want him to attack out of desperation, though. That's the thing. I'm worried that he's going to try to attack in one of my guys. But I need to get close enough to be able to talk to League Alt. Uh, he's only a level 8. Matthew's just like, might as well open if every door I see! If Merlinus dies, it's not the biggest deal. It's really not. If Raven dies, that's a pretty big deal. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. All right. Um, sorry, back to my own question. Uh, Grim Fandango, I finally played. Yeah. Amazing. Game. Oh, oh, favorite game might be Investigations Two, actually. Oh yeah, the fan translation. I'm working through that right now, actually. And it's, it's if good. You, if you are a Phoenix Wright fan, you owe it yourself to play that game. It's Only if you play really good. So far, right? right. Yeah. So I don't want to attack that guy. Um, I guess if we're counting games I have not completed, Earthbound is on that list. Mm -hmm. That's a really fun game. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to I keep Elwood there. I can't help but feel it's like a tiny bit overrated. Yeah, it probably is, is at this point. Like, oh my gosh, it's like the greatest game of all time. It's like, it's good in the things that it does to the RPG genre. That are like, new and it, fresh. It's just a nice so quirky nice. game, which is fun. Yeah, I've really enjoyed that. Um, I haven't finished it, though. Right. There's a lot of games that I'm like, right at the end, like Conquest, and... Yeah. Please do not attack me, other thief. <laughs> Hector's just a go, please. I also did finally beat Link's Awakening legitimately. Oh, so yeah. That's a really good game, too. It's, it's I do not think it's as good as Seasons of Ages, though. No, Seasons and Ages, like... Basically more, took that... They have more modern level design. Mm -hmm. Yay! No, I did not want that, but alright. Black Fang! <laughs> I hate Black Fang! Oh, it's like about to kill. <laughs> Which is funny, because oh, it's supposed to be like a pacifist, kind of. I want to know about the Black Fang. Okay, like, they're just like, hey, you guys, like, I want to know more about you guys. Can you join my team? Because, like, you okay! Thank goodness they find, like, the people who are, like, have the weakest all. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Oh, that's right. He's filled up on stuff. Sarah can take something. Yeah, Sarah's gonna have to take something. Give me that barrier staff, how about? Give me that. Oh, that's right. I don't think League Alt starts with a lockpick. Yes, he does. Good. Whew. Oh, wait. He starts oh, yeah, with a white room. Chests. Never mind. Well, I know, I think on Hector's story, he does not start with a lockpick. He starts with like, two chest keys, which I'm like, really? That's kind of stupid. Well, Lin is totally picking off that thief. Wait. Hang on. Iron Lance. Short Spear. Hey! And Armor Slayer. Okay. Well, Dark can take that. And, yeah, Lowen's just gonna hang around. Alright. Go, Link! Hick 
come to save the Princess Zelda. Ganon took her away, now the children don't play. Come on, these guys are pushovers. Helios Steel Sword doesn't have a lot of things, and this guy damages him. Oh, 11. Oh, never mind. I was looking at the Slim Lance guy. Yeah. Sorry, Merlinus. <laughs> I hope your tent is good at dodging. Matthew can take him out. I, can't I, I would not risk it. There's a guy uh, with a fire on the other side of that fence. What you could do is have Kent rescue Hector and bring him back to defend Merlinus. Hector's gonna head back that way just because that's like really the only place there's stuff over. I don't really care about killing these guys personally. Okay. So. Probably not. But you can't, I can't get rid of this guy. That's the main thing. Yeah. Thank goodness for Dart. Dart is amazing! <laughs> Ooh, Merlinus, you need to be better at dodging than that. Now, if Merlinus dies, he comes back. He's the right, he just doesn't level up. up. <laughs> but, like, he's not that good when he does level up. Also, oh, if Merlinus dies, I'm not going to be able to really buy a whole lot at the secret shop. Because there's, you can't oh, send there's anything. Secret, there's a secret shop on this level, right? Yep. Well, Actually, there are empty, two. Just empty League Alts inventory. Yeah, I can do that. Like, the Light Rune is not good. Hector's coming to town. And he will, when Link save the day. Hallelujah. I don't know why I say that with like a vague strong man. Hallelujah, Link come to town. I come to town to save the princess. Uh, hope that guy doesn't kill her. That's why I can't see him. Check his weapon. If it's a steel axe, she might be dead. Eight might check his strength. 16 minus whatever her defense is. Okay, she's, she'll live. Iron axes are more powerful than hand axes. So, sorry, Rebecca. Are you seriously going to do that? I was debating. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, I could steal his um, chest key. Probably not worth it. <laughs> yeah, that's really not worth it. Why is he going down? Oh, secret shop. shop. There's Where a secret shop there. Nevermind, this might still be alive. He'll die on this turn in front of me. Darn it! Darn it! Darn it! <laughs> it's way too much. <laughs> I'll just sell his light rune. I can oh, sell his steel sword too. Yeah, it's true. How much money do we even have? We don't that much, do we? I'm not gonna buy a ton, I'm just gonna... I think... Shop down here, I wanna say, has, like, all the killer weapons. And then the shop over here, I wanna say, has, like, lockpicks and weird staves and elixirs. I thought there was one on this level that had, like, a guy named Francis. No. That's much later in the game. Ooh, that's not good. Come at me, bro! Is Lynn actually going to take out that thief, or are you just going to talk about it? Oh yeah, she's going to. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, Lynn's totally going to take out that guy. Ah, uh, take out the pig. Thank you, Lynn. Who's going to take out that boss? Um, it could be group, group effort. Darwin? Darren. <laughs> Darwin. We're not monkeying around. You go, Sarah. Oh, yeah. Lowen's like, kind of poisoned over here. Do you think you could help? <laughs> Lowen's about got a bunch of stuff that's literally about to break, so he'll go with Lee Galt. And then you'll just wait. We can wait it out. Nice, Rebecca. 
want to. So. You can't always rely on that, though. I know. I can't believe Lin lived that whole time. <laughs> that was amazing. Oh, maybe not. Well, How he... did the tent dodge? Don't question it. Oh, what? That guy stinks. <laughs> it's a Pegasus Knight with a Slim Lance. Ooh! And for the magic... Oh, it's like, well, I, like, my body somehow processed it. <laughs> he slowly developed an immunity to the bubble up. <laughs> It's gotta be that one. Yeah, for sure. Oh, dart! Guess Oz. Wait, hang on. He doesn't have a chance. Got thunder. He has a crit chance, and Oswin's not had great luck. But fine. See, like Oswin dies. <laughs> he doesn't have a lot of stuff at the very you least. Have to take, like, yeah, what it's true. To their stuff? It just sits there. It, it just why it, it just disappears, disappears forever. Like it goes down. I'm gonna like lure him to use his hand axe. I think. Twenty-one damage. Oh man. Yeah, we're gonna have to get like Hector in there probably. <laughs> it's like oh oh no, boss is slightly powerful. Hector, please Hector, help. Please take him oh wait, hang on, weak alt. I love how fast he is. Alright. I like how there's the one song in this that sounds like Oscar the Grouch's I Hate Christmas. What? The Sarah song. I'll show you what I'm not sure. We'll think of something. He's got a silver. I'm just checking. The key is to make him use his hand axe. So that way, he's a lot less of a threat. Or just use ranged attacks against him. We're gonna get, like, terrible strategy ratings. More like stuff. Sorry, Berlinus. That Not doesn't... That even before my finest goods get stared. That's a weird voice for Merlinus. It's like, well, Hector, you're just so good at killing that I don't think you're gonna get very much experience. <laughs> not, not the wall. Why would you really want to destroy a wall with dark magic? <laughs> Someone's Shaman. been brewing. Whoa! Nice level up. Oh, mmm, cheat sandwich. Oops. Mine. Mine. No! <laughs> well, I was supposed to figure out, are we gonna have another one? <laughs> Kill the one with the steel, Lance. Yeah. It's like, Hector, I really don't think you should be doing this. Whoosh! Floor is yours, Art. Excellent. I'm not. I was seeing how well he would fare. The answer is how not very well. Hi. I suppose I could just be barrier, 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 barrier. Get a lot of EXP. Does not barrier just increase resistance? Yeah, but it also gives you more EXP than your average bear. Here, I don't know. Ha, ha, ha. Did you guys hear about the new update to, uh... Uh, New Leaf. Uh, I heard there was one. It's apparently, I, I don't have it yet, but I heard it's uh, quite big. Wow. Good for Nintendo on updating their old stuff for free. <laughs> uh, Kanas has that guy. Help me, Sarah. I'm dying. Eh, I bet a heal will do it. Not quite. <laughs> Alright, let's go to the secret shop, shall we? Secret 
It's Anna. All right, you may buy my light rune. Ooh, killer weapons. Chest keys and lock. I don't know. Ninian starts with elixirs. I know. Well, I mean, I'm not going to benefit from the bow. Does Dart want a killer axe? Not yet. Really? You don't really have anybody who'd be, who'd make a killer lance worth it. I guess it's true, yeah. Who doesn't really need it? I wonder if a killing edge could be good. Buh bye Now there's a reference! <laughs> yeah, that's good. Chest. Oh! That's like the best weapon in the game. I just realized if he opens the chest, yeah. he has to get Yeah. Unless you tr Oh! Why do the chest keys have to have so many uses? That's money. Probably the vulnerabilities would be the best thing to throw away. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Hector's like as far away from where we need him as possible. That is my guy, and you are not attacking the boss with him. Yep. Now you know how I feel when you got Kent. I'm like, every cavalier is well win. Ain't it about time to take on the boss? The boss is yours. The floor is yours. Alright. Impressive. Ah, uh, who am I kidding? He's gonna survive a hand axe. Hopefully. Ha ha ha, you dare challenge me, I'd rule the world again. Dude, you live on like a weird little island. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, Dart has good growth rates. You're not going to the other shop, are you? No. Just but, might as well level up low one while we can. Da 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 da! He's like, oh, I think this is all the rage. It appeared on the front of Fashion Weekly. Oh, that's true. I think we get another one soon. Yeah, actually, I think on the Indian lately. He's like, oh, I healed all that back. Oh, really? I'm gonna just like kind of gain them up. I'm gonna gain up, I think. That'll probably miss. Dang it, that Disney. Right. Well, I guess I should think how much damage will this silver lance do? 14 plus 14, that's 28. So he'll survive. And if he gets hit by this, I can just retreat. Oh, hi Lynn will not survive. So, I just want to see... She actually will deal a decent amount of damage. You can't rescue both Elwood and her, though. That's put, her over, put her by Oswald in the room, too. Then you can't attack with Oswald. Right. Nobody can rescue Lynn if she's... There. Correct. Except Kent. There's no point in moving the Well, I guess I'll put Wallen closer. Plus, since it's a Seize Throne level, everyone should get healed. Yes, Sarah needs the EXP. We can always cut that part out of the video. You can stay. So, if I attack him, will Kent rescue her? He can rescue her and then move away. 
That's how Cavalier. You won't be able to move that far, though. He'll be able to move out of range of his hand axe. She's going there. There's no way she's actually gonna, like, kill the boss, though. If she crits. If she crits. What? Why? There's a lot of, like, dissing of <laughs> family members in this game. All Dane! One health left. I don't think she can damage him. Dart, hang on. No, actually, that's a fairly low chance. That's even lower. That is even lower, except if he does that, he's guaranteed to survive. Can't do that then. Boom! Blood, is this my blood? I'm ruler of that the guy, world. Like, really thinks he's the ruler of the world. Like, man. Yeah. Shook your toe, man. <laughs> that's an exception. <laughs> Oh, that was a clever one, actually. Alright, time for the healing. Everybody come closer. What's wrong? Come a little close? If I ever did a Star Fox 64 Let's Play, it would probably just be quoting all the lines before they happen. <laughs> A Star Fox 64 Let's Play, would you do like multiple save play on the levels? Probably. Because that game you can beat in like an hour. It's true. You also have to start with like the bad playthrough. Yeah. Don't heal everybody. Yes, I'm healing everybody. Uh, you're not gonna have any healer red steps. Well, we, we're going to shops next episode, so that doesn't matter. This is like the only way to level up your healers really well. I don't want to do the arena glitch. I'm not doing the arena glitch. There you go, Lowen. Please be a good level up. <laughs> hey, you can level her up now. <laughs> She's had a ton of really terrible level ups, though. It always defaults to barrier now. That's kind of annoying. That's gonna come back to bite us. It's gonna be like, all we need to do is heal this one get barrier. No! <laughs> well, everyone survived except Merlinus, so I'd say that's pretty good. And now we get to watch the really long movie scene. Hey, no spoiling it before it happens. Didn't Darren have two R's? <laughs> Sam and Ella just said Darren with one R. He dared to do that. Final level. Yep. But we're not going here just yet. I've come to save ya. I've come to finish. <laughs> We basically get a part. <laughs> Actually, I think he might say stay back. <laughs> it's Ninian with the creepy red eyes, as opposed to the cute red eyes she normally has. Albert. Yeah, Albert. He's like Dilbert's brother. <laughs> That's Builder. That was a pretty sweet entrance, Jafar. Yeah. How come you can't do that Shall one? Not pass. What do you think Jafar's like arm tattoo actually is? <laughs> um, I don't know. What do you think Sammy Screwdriver's? <laughs> <laughs> it's like you see it start. Yeah. It looks like a lizard. Yeah, he has like a weird patch of hair. He seems like pretty smooth, man. <laughs> well, I can't wait till we get Jafar. Then we'll have a, ki a killing machine on our side. Ooh, check out that, like, earthbound like background. <laughs> yeah, that's true. It doesn't look like Power. Power! <laughs> it's basically Star Wars Episode 3 all over again. Father. Father. 
ever? Check out this awesome cinematic. It's keyboard vans. Yeah. What's happening? Hey look, I have dragons on my TV. The dragon is ripped. Look at that. Is that truly a dragon? It's like, no, it's not. Just kidding. <laughs> Nils to the rescue. Nils has like the weirdest haircut. It's like he's shaggy in the front, but then it's like cut in like a weird like square in the back. <laughs> And the Nurgle's just like, meh. <laughs> Dude, you should have just teleported out of the way, seriously. Are you seeing some hilarious Kermit the Frog memes? No, so I'm on Facebook and I will not reveal who this is. But someone has a status that says, Heard my ex is with a ginger now. That works and she has no soul. Okay. Gingers apparently don't have soul. Yeah, I, I've heard that before, but that's like a stupid thing. Well, yeah. Apparently it was started because in Renaissance depictions of the Last Supper, Judas is a ginger. A lot of the time. So? I don't know, but that's apparently where it started, and then South Park did a thing about it. Oh, no. I'm more familiar with Renaissance paintings than South Park. Yeah. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Which is not saying much. And now we get the faint of Elwood crying. Did you think that was the end of the game? No, nah, this is like the halfway point now. Father! But you'll just have to find out what happens next on the next episode of the Fire Emblem. Thanks for watching, I'm Colorful Artie. And I'm like the 64. And we will see you next time, hopefully. Have a great day and God bless.